Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to the Be Inspired event uh, today. We're delighted to have with us uh, Chris Horn from Iona Technologies, Matt Norton from uh, Century Wireless, uh, Andy Hurst from I I iTabs, and Conal Moron, who is um, from the uh, Sunday Business Show. We raised money for this business by a combination of, of private investments and with some state support. And there's two things I would say on that. One is, I think for most of us, you can put the stories you read on the back page of the business post away about people who've gone out and raised three, four, five million for their business. Most companies like ours, I think Matt will be the same. You know, you're raising small amounts of money off guys that you find through your local accountants or through your local county enterprise board. There's a, there's a real thrill um, and it is a roller coaster ride working for yourself. Um, and there are at least as many lows, if not twice as many lows as there are highs. But I would say that the highs more than compensate for any of the lows. At the same time, what I would say is that uh, I take calculated risks. So I knew what I was bringing to the party. I knew that, you know what, if it all goes belly up, where am I going to be? Well, I've got a track record of business. I could go back into large corporate land and get myself another job. So I went looking for a tech entrepreneur. It was actually the hottest program that I found it in. My own background, I'm 53, uh, electronics engineer at a Trinity, graduated in 78. Uh, stayed on to do a PhD there in the computing department. And handed in my PhD on a Friday, and then the following Monday, my, my supervisor, Michael Purser, had arranged that I had a one-year uh, uh, job in the European Commission in DG13 in Brussels. But I also went into um, Stanford's computer science department and met the, about the only European there, a guy called, a Belgian guy, Andy Bettlesham. Um, and he was working on some hardware for, electronics hardware for, for graphics, you know, for the screens. And he and a couple of other guys just formed a company called the Stanford University Network, or SUN, which became Sun Microsystems. And I was so inspired by Andy, who was a guy about my own age, and uh, I was looking at what he was doing and thinking, you know, he's doing what we do back in Ireland, <laughs> and these guys can do this. I, I sort of, I, I was expected to be awed by the valley, but when I went over there, I discovered they were just the same as us. They were doing similar sort of things, just as, um, I don't know, experimental and having fun and playing with things and wanting to form a company, but I sort of came back absolutely convinced if, if they can do it, so can we. They're not better than us. We're just as good as them. We formed uh, Iona, and three of us, so with three academics, uh, Sean and I, Henri, sorry, Sean and I were both on the faculty. Uh, Henri was a research assistant. And um, you know, the first thing you do when you form a company is you're supposed to develop a business plan, as, as Bill mentioned, and Tom, you know, you write, what's your business plan? Okay, we'll write a business plan. Christmas 1993, Sun came in, they bought 25% of the company for 600K. I was, uh, it was approved by the Sun board through the CEO, Scott McNeely, and I was able to then put Motorola in contact with Scott, and he, he verified the story, uh, yeah, absolutely. Sun think these guys in Dublin are great, we're licensing the technology, we're coming onto their board. We got the deal with Motorola, Iridium, a big deal. We were then mandated by Motorola across the whole Iridium program throughout all of their subcontractors. Uh, we took the company public in 1997. Um, Sun sold their 25% holding uh, at the IPO. In the history of NASDAQ, it was the fifth largest, fifth largest ever IPO and uh, Sun got $60 million back. Thank everybody that's here for, for, um, for participating and asking the questions and getting to the heart of uh, entrepreneurship and being inspired by it.